events that did take place, especially like a Kadira or a Manzuka who lived in, in Germany for so many years, uh, Ter Stegen as well. They'll be, they'll be um, hearing things, I'm sure. But right now, it'll be all focus um, on this game. And, um, you know, there is Mark Ter Stegen will play in goal. I'm very, I'm very interested to see Sergio Roberto on the right, Matteo on the left, if it is Matteo. They like to go forward. Barcelona likes to play. And those could be two areas where Juventus could pick them off when they do go forward, as we saw Paris Saint-Germain do to them at home a little bit ago. But you always have to be aware, we say it time and time again, of Neymar, Suarez, and Messi up front. Higuain leading the attack for the old lady. This is a rematch of the 2015 Champions League final, and that's won by Messi 3-1 to one in Berlin. We're going to join you next at halftime. We'll have all the latest on the developing situation in Dortmund. But let's exhale for a moment and take in some wonderful soccer. Guy Mowbray, Danny Higginbottom with the call. All set for the green light. All set for the Champions League quarterfinal first leg to begin in Turin. These are just two big hitters, and there's the first hit of the match towards goal, although albeit a rather tentative one from Sami Kadira. It's very interesting with Juventus. You look at three of the front four, used to playing his centre confidence from that, and I believe that they can be unbeatable no matter what happens. Dybala tapped up unfairly by Iniesta. Clear free kick. Bit of a test for the referee early on. Does he go yellow so soon? See, here's a late shot. Janic who takes the free kick. Saved by Tostegan, but what on earth happened to the Barcelona back line there? Of all people to leave free, Gonzalo Higuain. You can see he's quite clearly on side there. From Barcelona, you saw they were, how they were lining up. And he's very much zonal in hard box, and I would imagine that Juventus in every opportunity to try and do that. Tostegan gets it away in a fashion, but he needed Mascherano to react quickly to make sure Pjanic couldn't take it up. And it is the one that stands out as perhaps not being up there with the likes of Luis Suarez. You can see Quadrado, both arms in the air, and here he goes. Taking on Mathieu. Clever little ball for Dybala! Superbly finished! Barcelona opened up. Juventus at it from the off. Messi's heir apparent has given Juventus the lead against Messi's Barcelona. Well, we talked about getting the ball to, to, to Cuadrado as much as they could. See Matthew here, you can see he's a centre-back dropping off and dropping off. Fantastic first touch from Dybala to open up the space for him. Really is an exquisite finish, but Juventus, as I've said, they pin pinpointed that area from the first minute. And Cuadrado, he played the ball to Dybala probably had more touches than anyone else on the pitch and it's something that they will continue to do but what a fantastic finish from Dybala no way past Chiellini Suarez was after him though and a free kick for Barcelona just outside the penalty area Messi brought down okay. Chiellini had absolutely no idea that Suarez was there you can see it's Messi who fires towards goal it was neither shot nor cross in the end Marking Messi his name up not past Dani Alves, but Benucci was there. He took her over, and that's where the goal, the goal came from as well. Most likely to be swung in by Dybala's left foot. No, oh, it's Pjanic with the right footer. Messi. He's managed to slide it through to Iniesta. What a save by Buffon. And he celebrates as though he's just scored himself. What a ball by one of the best players in the world, and what a save by one of the best goalkeepers in the world. This is a magical ball from Messi. Fantastic run from Iniesta. What a save from Buffon, that is. 39 years young. Not on the wrong side of Dani Alves. And Zukic. Played back to Dybala. What a strike that is! Dybala with two for Juventus. Feel the noise in Turin. There's an Argentinian stealing the show. Lionel Messi is playing second fiddle to him. 
A Dybala double puts Juventus in control. What a finish, but it's all about the movement as well. Dybala just timed his run perfectly in that number 10 role. Defence of Barcelona dropping and dropping and dropping, and he just keeps that yard or so away, making sure that he creates that space. It's another really quick break, but you see him getting in between the midfield and the defence. No one tracking him. We talked about Mascherano before the game. He can't keep up with him. Switches off. So Stegen will be disappointed to be beaten at the near post, but I think it's a sheer power. Goes on the wrong side of PK as well, and to Stegen, if anything's unsighted. But it's all about Dybala just taking that position up between the Barcelona defence and the midfield where you want. I see Roberto, who got him. And that's not a free kick. Oh, it is now. The flag is up for... Was it offside as Messi puts the ball in the net? It won't count anyway. The flag was waved, the whistle went. Everybody else stopped. It's interesting, it looks as though he has given offside. Which is the... Quadrado teases Matthew and then brought in Pjanic. That was wild. They have a real problem down this side. Barcelona, Quadrado, he's getting... Matthew swings one over, that was a great cross. Suarez got something on it, it was blocked from behind. It's a great ball in from Matthew and Suarez. He's got on the wrong side there. And Chiellini, Chiellini's not been able to track his run. He's been a little bit fortuitous there. And for a corner. Chiellini. In now from Neymar. The header was missed by Suarez. Mandzukic sweeps it back to him. Away from Rakitic to find Higuain. Higuain's effort only parried. Just enough on that from Ter Stegen. And turned behind gratefully by Matthew. Matthew was in a good position. I think he was very worried to Stegen here. It comes very, very awkward. Bounces just before him. He doesn't want to take any chances, but he's got away with it. Unless he knows more than us, and he was that sort of Dalla delivery. That has gone out for another corner. Juventus try and tangle now with Pjanic and Kadira. It's only just over Bonucci's head, and that will do it for the half. Juventus now 396 straight minutes without conceding in the Champions League. Two early goals from the... He's gone over to left back. With Mascherano just dropping back into that position. And then obviously Gomez will come in. And that role that Mascherano had at first. You can see it, can't we? 4-3-3. Three, three. Lined up for us at the start. Sergio Roberto at right back. And it's Rakitic, Gomez, Iniesta... Messi, Suarez, Neymar. Juventus will stay as they are. It's a four for his Neymar, or nearly Neymar. It's Messi now! Measured the shot wide. He claims it took an instant deflection, and that's why it went wide. Well, it's fantastic defending the first from Chiellini. That's an outstanding challenge, but then Messi's quickest. Kadira. Kadira's gone for goal. That cannot have been far away. Iniesta. Played through towards Luis Suarez, and Buffon is on it quickly. With a wink. Well, they've got on the wrong side of Chiellini here. Sorry, Benucci. He's trying to win the ball. Neymar. One in hope rather than expectation. Middle arriving is Messi and Sergio Roberto. And there was the follow-up from Iniesta. Rising high. Fantastic play, great running, running from Suarez, but once again, we talk about forward. Big way holds back. Nobody saw him do that, and it was on target. Saved by Ter Stegen. It's happened on so many occasions this evening. There's such a big gap between the midfield and defence. You can see Higuain, he just holds back. like he meant it. Now, onside. Higuain, straight at Ter Stegen. And it's in. Headed towards goal the post and in, it's Chiellini who's made it three. One of the grand old men playing for the grand old lady of Italy. The corner had pace, it had height. It was just wonderful for Giorgio Chiellini to make it Juventus three, Barcelona nil. Well, we've spoken about it before, the zonal marking, near enough for Barcelona. Smallest man on the pitch, marking arguably the biggest man on the pitch. Only ever going to be one winner.
It wasn't going to be Mascherano. Give full credit to Chiellini, though, to win the ball, but then the direction as well, back towards where it's come from. Fantastic header. And Juventus really are in dreamland. A player who's got extra incentive. It will feel like that if it becomes four. There's Kadira. And a... Let's see wriggles away from Kadira. Oh, Suarez wasn't ready. Look at the PK. Alexandro had a hold. Bala trying to get through, there wasn't a gap, and he knows that's not a penalty. Rakitic is really far over on the right in the second half. Good ball from Messi, in towards Suarez, who's put it past the post. Benucci was all over him, he couldn't stop it. There might have been a little nick on it wide. Messi. Another incisive ball for Andre Gomez. It's in wonder whether it hits Chiellini's hand. It does. It's an interesting one there. Nobody appealed for it. We just said there what we thought happened did actually happen. Suarez did. Luis Suarez did. It's off the face onto the hand, which makes very, it a little bit very, different, doesn't it? Yeah, very difficult to give anything against that. But it's Iniesta. It's Rakitic, and it was clipped through beautifully by Pjanic, Kadira's offside. Ball's in the net, but it isn't number four. That's really good link up play. Pjanic is figure too often in Juventus starting lineups. Alexandro doesn't deal with it, Sergio Roberto. And it's blazed high by Luis Suarez, he had to take it quickly. Pop. Neymar skips past Bonucci. Trying to play it into Messi and Suarez was in the way. It will be a corner, though. Just fear of getting a little bit outnumbered there. We've seen Benucci, he got taken out of the game because Alves. Iniesta. It's a beautiful ball in. And Buffon comes out to get it away. It's Barcelona fury that that's been deemed a foul. Juventus free kick. They're not happy at all. Four to aim for. And a whole goal to aim for. It's too high for Samuel Umtiti. A good opportunity, PK and City in particular, not being marked, it was just too hard, and it was his masterclass in first half finishing. Messi, foul, Rincon a little unwise to rush in, it is Messi, straight into the wall, Suarez, Suarez, Mascherano, Rakitic, that's wild. The board will be going. Neymar heading goalwards, but it's easy for Buffon, and it will be the last action of the match. The Champions League shutout streak extends to 441 minutes. Folks in Turin, ecstatic. 3 0 over mighty Barcelona. Neymar and company held in check again. But there may be those wearing those colors that are saying, we got.